Has Wendy found her fated werewolf mate? Every werewolf has one true love destined by the moon. <laughs> Well, that was quite easy, actually. I love the storyline of that as well. Like the fact that, you know, they should be enemies, but instead they're lovers. Hello, my friends, and welcome back to the third and probably final part of our little werewolves mini series. I've got two goals today. Number one, I would like to try and fight the pack alpha and see if I can become the pack alpha. And number two, I want to explore a little bit more about this faded mate gameplay. I've been spending a lot of time with Taylor trying to work on building up her fitness skill, and she's level seven now, which I think is a good sign, but she's not quite quite an apex wolf, so I don't really know like what goes into being able to fight the alpha and like become the alpha yourself, but hopefully being like a pretty good wolf and also pretty strong will be all that we need. My dog is on my side, clearly. I feel bad because I really do quite like Rory, but I also like myself and I want to be powerful. <laughs> like I've got this become alpha of the wild fangs task, so I might as well try. Where? exactly is the- okay, there she is. Bess, leave me alone. I'm clearly very busy. But you see, when I click on Rory and I go onto the werewolf pack thing, I can challenge the leader for the alpha rank, and you can do an epic tug of war and also an honorable brawl. I've been testing this, like I played it a bunch on stream yesterday. I lost the brawl, but I won the tug of war. I don't really know what to expect for us, but I'm gonna try the tug of war. <laughs> because I feel like I've had better luck with that personally, but I did only try it twice. So there's not exactly a big sample pool here. Oh God, I'm actually kind of scared for this. Also, we look very similar. I don't think I've noticed that yet. And they're just going for it. Like we're already starting. Oh, already? That was just it? Oh my God. Well, no, 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 no. Can I not do it again? I challenged the alpha two recently. Oh, I'm such a failure. Can I get you to like werewolf spar with me or something? No, forget it, forget it. I'm going, no. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm switching Sims and I'm gonna see if Wendy wants to go out and maybe try and meet somebody. So I've been trying to do some experimenting and like research. Uh oh. Oh, you're gonna turn. <laughs> I've been trying to do some like experimenting and research on the Faded Mates gameplay because obviously we had one Sim get a Faded Mate, but it was her, her fiance, so it's not that surprising. And I was told by one of the Sim gurus that worked on this pack that your Sim has a chance of having a Faded Mate with any werewolf they flirt with. So it's not like the first werewolf you flirt with, it's just if you flirt with a werewolf, you might have that sim become your fated mate. Like if you're both werewolves, there's a chance of them becoming your fated mate. So you can kind of control who it is based on who you're flirting with, right? You won't just get like a random sim as your fated mate, but you also can't necessarily tell the game like, pick this person because it's just a chance. Okay, and everyone showing up are spellcasters. <laughs> so I can't even get one. Oh my God. Okay, hang on. What if she tried to flirt with Rory? It's kind of juicy, right? Because Rory is like the leader of the other pack. She's kind of the enemy. Of course, my sister is right there. I think I'm gonna go try. Ahoy me matey. Sure. Oh, I should turn into a werewolf, huh? <laughs> I probably- Oh my god, can I still not? I still don't have transformation mastery! Oh my god. <laughs> This game is so annoying. Well, I don't know if I can even ask to rock boat. I don't know if I'll even get a faded mate if I'm not a werewolf. I mean, I am, but I'm not like currently. I've kind of really flopped with this let's play, huh? Do you want to give her like a flower? See if she likes it? Oh, oh no, I did get a faded mate. <laughs> even if I'm not turned, I did. Has Wendy found her faded werewolf mate? Every werewolf has one true love destined by the moon. <laughs> Well, that was quite easy, actually. I love the storyline of that as well. Like the fact that, you know, they should be enemies, but instead they're lovers. Oh, Gossip about booty. First kiss? No way. Do you think it'll work? Don't say no. Don't say no. Don't say no. Don't say no. <gasps> she said yes. Well, I'm not gonna complain about that. Asked to be girlfriend? No, okay, we're moving a bit fast now. Okay, <laughs> well, there you go. So. Wendy has the it's fate sentiment about Rory, but Rory doesn't have it back? That's a bit mm, concerning, <laughs> I won't lie. Okay, bye I guess, thank you. Thank you so much. Well, I'm kind of curious to see what happens if you like don't follow along the faded mate gameplay. Like if say I were to go try and flirt with somebody else, like if I wanted to come flirt with like a spellcaster or something, just literally anyone who isn't my faded mate, I wonder what would happen. And Look, we don't even like Kyle. I was planning on dumping Kyle from day one. Sure, he's my faded mate, whatever. Sure, we're engaged, whatever. That's not my problem. But 
what happens if you try and flirt with somebody else? Oh god, Caleb hates me. Literally despises my suit. Asked to rock a boat, you wanna try it? Okay, I don't think she liked it. Not meant to be. Tense plus three from flirting with someone other than your fated mate. Something feels indescribably wrong about all this. Can Taylor defy fate? Oh my gosh. All right, that feels like a little bit dramatic to me, I won't lie, but whatever. <laughs> That's fine. Should I just pee on the floor because I'm angry about it? I'm feeling tense. This will help me. And it also, it helps with my werewolf world domination, so I might just go for it. The fact that you can pee this much and it's so smelly, it's like absolutely horrifying. Who gave me this power? I, sh I should not be allowed to do this. Okay, everybody hates me for peeing on the floor, but I'm having a good time. I don't see the issue. I could fully finish this entire task just by peeing, and I think I shall. Oh, I also had some things that I wanted to donate to pack resources. I got an extra one of these shards, I already had it, and I also got this like We're Living magazine, so I'm gonna, or I guess Wear Living, <laughs> so I might donate that too. Okay, now I should probably actually go home because it's a bit late. Oh, maybe in the morning I'll dump my fiance. I don't have a reason. I think I just realized that, you know, I, I want to be with somebody else. I don't know who that somebody else is. I haven't picked them yet, <laughs> but I I want to be with somebody else. Why are you so far away? How did- how? Freezing to death? Are you kidding? Can you freeze to death while you're sleeping? I probably shouldn't let that happen, but I kind of want to let it happen. <laughs> oh my god, it's snowing and they're sleeping on the floor outside. I really should- I really should have you change. I really should have you change. Okay, cold weather outfit. Come on. Well, happy first day of winter. What? Why am I so angry? Oh, the beast beckons. I didn't even do anything. Why are you so furious all the time? At this point, I'm kind of like, maybe I'll just embrace it. I literally had to like delay starting to record because I wanted to finish one of her little rampages and now she's already doing one again. It's been 13 real life minutes. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Come on, just do it. It's fine. Well, you did find one of these new figurines so we can put this on the shelf. Something I've noticed about this shelf is that stuff slots to it. So for example, with this, it automatically puts the like other shard of this vase in the right spot. That's how I knew I had an extra one of these. We donated it already. But like how cool is that that it's gonna like slot all the collectibles into the exact right place? I'm gonna come do some more contributing to pack resources while I'm here because I've got so much stuff. You're scaring the dog and you're peeing on the floor in the house. Stop. Oh my gosh. Just go scavenge the ground. This is better because if you're hunting, you might at least get something beneficial. You are extremely concerning. <laughs> oh, we're now a beta in the wild fangs. <gasps> oh, we're getting there. And you peed in the house again. Okay, cool. Thank you. Well, we did get a prize. It gave me this like not accurate sundial. Oh, I can't take it out of my inventory because I'm rampaging. Or no, I'm not. I'm actually fine now. Okay, well, something else I learned that I can do is completely destroy people's entire houses. So my next plan for today is that I'd like to go to Oasis Springs and just completely break everything in the land grab's house. Literally everything. Like, I intend to come here and destroy every appliance in this home. I am absolutely tormenting this family. Oh my god, I can't smash the kitchen because it's too expensive! These are like the 13,000 simoleon fridges, so they're not breakable, but I can break your stupid sink and I will break everything else in your house. I'm serious. I'll scratch up all of your furniture. I'll smash the TV. Okay, I'll smash it in a second. I will smash the TV. You will pay for what you've done. I don't know what it is that you've done, but you'll pay for it. Oh, I'm a werewolf menace. Wow, Taylor was a real bully. She has learned to revel in scaring other sims and no longer feels guilty about it. Oh no. Wait, so I like unlocked the werewolf menace dormant ability? All right, I also wanted to get the curse bearer one because then I can turn sims. Look at this. Wait, is, is anybody here? Oh yes, indeed. Okay. I can literally just click on them and curse bite. Boom, done. Wolf. <laughs> and I got one of my three turned. Who else should I turn? Is anybody else home? Or are they all at like work or something? Oh, boring. Nobody's home. Okay. Well, actually, I was gonna travel, but there's some randoms. Like, Katrina Caliente is just walking around. Should I come cursed bite her? Stay right where you are. I'm coming and I have big plans. Hi, Katrina. So good to see you. Um, not good for you to see me, but hi. Um, maybe just like, no, I want to pick somebody more exciting. Hillary's from the wedding pack, and for that, she deserves to suffer. That game pack was cursed, as is my bite, so. Bye! Or I guess I should say hi, because you're gonna be a part of my group now. Okay, I'm also only like six away. I have to pee like six more times from getting my werewolf world domination, so I might try finish that really fast. Come on, mark territory. What are you doing? Are you building a sand castle? Oh, don't do that. Mark your territory. Make the land grab suffer. Come on, I'm so close to being done peeing in their yard. One more, one more. There 
we go. Okay, and the last thing we have to do for the aspiration is become alpha of the wild fangs. Not really sure how that's gonna go, but I'll try. I will say the world looks pretty cool in the snow, but you know what looks cooler? Um, beating up Rory. <laughs> I would very much like to challenge you with an honorable brawl. I would very much like to win. I don't think I will, because I'm not even an apex wolf yet, but I'll try. Oh, here we go. Honorable brawl. Uh, I want to win. They look the same. I don't even know who to root for. I didn't even realize. It's the shirt being the same color. It's like a different shirt, but the same color. Come on. I'm actually getting scared. Oh, she beat me. Oh, now I'm very angry. I'm gonna rampage again. Oh, no. Wait, somber howl. That helps a little bit. What's happening to you people? What did I do? Are you gonna freeze? Oh, if so, that's scary. Oh, wait. I'm not the only person around here who grew up in San Myshuno, but I am the only person who came over within the last few decades. The city life wasn't for me. I wanted something more close-knit. A pack, if you will. Interesting. I love the, like, storyline and the lore behind that. I wonder who else is from San Myshuno. I've got an extra ticket to the hottest opera in town. Okay, maybe. I don't think it's Christopher, but maybe he's invited me to the city to go see an opera. Right now, I'm actually trying to see if I can get Wendy to rampage because I would very much like for her to get the ability to transform because she still can't. And to do that, she has to rampage without scaring anybody. And since it's nighttime and there's mostly just wolves around, I think we'd probably be okay if she rampaged like now. No, wait, did one of my two- Oh my god. I think that my one of my pack mates must have talked me down because she's not even furious anymore. Oh my god. <laughs> it just disappeared. She's never gonna turn. Okay, maybe I spend the rest of my life just not mastering my werewolf abilities. That's fine. Oh, that one's extra. We already have that. Okay, cool. But that one is new. I'm hoping to gain some fury from sleeping at nighttime. Oh, are you rampaging again? What am I supposed to do to help you? If you're gonna behave like this, honestly, how am I supposed to help you? Can you and your sister switch places? <laughs> I ask you this honestly. Can you and your sister switch places? Yep, there we go. Rampaging. Again. <laughs> your sister won't do it at all. It's so annoying. Do you think it's safe to mark your territory in the snow? I mean, yeah, but it's probably gonna end badly. Oh, what if we went and destroyed stuff? I'm rampaging. I might as well. Let's go bother the goth family. <laughs> Let's go embrace it. That's the whole point of the wild fangs, right? Is to um embrace my rampaging and destroy. Let me in. Oh, I can't get into the house. Oh, boring. Did I have to be in there first? Well, I could probably at least turn Bella. Hang on. Cursed bite. Bella. Oh, this is the old Bella still. That's kind of weird to see her. I had to take out the SDX files because I was having like a weird cast glitch. They fixed it by the time the pack actually came out, but like I started recording this when I still had early access. So, oh, that's actually really weird. <laughs> I didn't even, I, I haven't seen the goths yet, so I didn't notice. This is probably like the last save I'll ever have them with the old goth family. Oh, Taylor is now the apex werewolf. She's one of the best, the cream of the crop, top of the food chain. The final tier of abilities are now available for purchase. Oh my gosh. Okay, well there's this alpha wolf one so that we win most fights and challenges against other werewolves. I say we pick that one and then go try and challenge the alpha again because at this point I feel like we should be able to do it. We have the high fitness skill, we have the wolf rank, we've got the perks, like, if I don't win this, I don't know what you need to do to win. Oh my god, it's storming so much. Okay, werewolf pack, challenge leader for alpha rank, honorable brawl. I don't think the wolves get cold. <laughs> I think they're fine. Come on, win this time. The way the other guy just like went inside and didn't care. I lost again? I suck. I actually suck. Maybe I will go dump my fiance then. I feel like I might as well do something. I'm in a bad mood. Kyle's boring. I want to see what happens when, <laughs> when you break up with your fated mate. Embrace fate and elope? Tie the knot right here right now? Oh wait, should we do that? Sorry, that's different. Oh my god, they weren't kidding. Oh no, I'm marrying him. This is a mistake. Well, I can marry him and then get divorced. Like, that's fine. Who is to stop me? This is like, what, the second time I've talked to Kyle in this entire little Let's Play? <laughs> I've barely even interacted with him. I'm sorry, Kyle. You're just not important to me. I hate to say it, but it's true. You're just not. What a beautiful ceremony. Why aren't you in your wolf form? This would be like a lot cuter if you were. Oh. okay, congrats. Love you. Oh, I don't want to move in with you. Ew. No, sorry. We can move in later. We shouldn't move in. We shouldn't do that. Faded to wed. Like a storybook, it was meant to be all along. And Kyle is deeply in love with me. All right, well, Kyle, <laughs> I'm sorry to say this, but would you like to get divorced? Please, I want to see what happens. It's very important. Kyle, don't you run away from me. We just got married. He actually left. I think he must have gone to work, but you actually, like, you left? <laughs> we just got married and you left. <laughs> Maybe I should have had him move in. That's my bad, I guess. I'm going home. 
I'm in a bad mood. Bills have just been delivered. Oh, so annoying. I'll pay them. It's fine. Don't worry. Oh, you're cold. Oh, I guess I don't have a thermostat. <laughs> so that's my bad. Oh, can I try and convince myself to turn into a werewolf? I've got another ability point. What can I do that would like make me furious? Devour objects to satisfy hunger. I don't think my pack's gonna like that, but I think I'll like that. So, um, guess I might go to the library and just start eating stuff? Devour. <laughs> Werewolf. Devour. Look, I'm not kidding, by the way. Like, you literally can eat the whole thing. It does make her sad. Um, oh, I can eat the book too. But yeah, shockingly, she doesn't like it when she does things like this, but I like it when I do things like this. So I'm just gonna eat up the entire place, I think. I mean, why not, right? Oh, I'm now a prime werewolf, so that's good. Devour this, devour this, devour this. <laughs> just keep it coming. Thank you. No, no, finish devouring. What are you doing? Don't talk to yourself. Eat it. Eat this too. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'm so close to rampaging. I'm gonna go back home now, and I think I'm gonna try and lock her in my house. Because again, to get the transformation mastery, I have to successfully rampage without scaring anybody. So I think if I go in the house, let me get the dog out. Okay, no, no, no. Come back inside. Come back inside. Only you inside. And then we lock the door. Lock door for everyone. And then here, you can you can scratch some stuff if it makes you feel better. Oh, we're so close. We're so close to rampaging. Come on. You can just look. Yeah, you want to groom yourself? Does that help? You can smash this. I won't mind. It's okay. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Now finish your little rampage. You can keep scratch. I won't mind. I just want you to be in here safe and sound so that I can transform. Oh my gosh. And Taylor found the diary. Duh. Oh, we'll have to read that in a second. I meant to read that in the beginning of the episode and then I forgot. That was like the whole cliffhanger of last week. Yes, I'm back. The pack has noticed that Wendy hasn't been adequately demonstrating diplomacy. Oh, shut up. I only just now learned how to transform. <laughs> like, leave me alone. You, you know what? Dare I say, the pack hasn't been adequately helping out their pack members because none of them helped me. All right, I'm gonna read this diary of Greg because I am so curious to see what it has to say. And I guess for my pack diplomacy, I have to avoid being mean to non-werewolf sims in werewolf form. And I also have to be friendly and welcoming towards non-werewolves while in beast form. So maybe we'll go out and we'll do that today. Maybe you could just like work on fixing some of the stuff that you destroyed. <laughs> this particular entry, oh my gosh, appears to have a shimmering enchantment over top that Taylor is able to read through. John and Maria are interested in a cure. Not for themselves, they'll be quick to tell you, but for others who might not wish this curse upon themselves or their loved ones. We've been researching as a group and theorized that a mixture of wolfsbane and moon petal might do the trick. The problem is the rarity of moon petal makes experimentation slow and failure discouraging. I'll admit only here, dear unknown reader, I have considered taking the cure. It would allow me more time with Avelina, and yet we would lose access to our bond, for she is my fated mate. What would become of that connection were I to transform back and never be beast again? There must be another way. Taylor learned how to make the wolf be gone cure? I learned how to make the cure from that? Wait, and if that's supposed to be like Greg's diary, does that mean that the wedding ring that Greg has is for that Avelina Sim? See, that sort of goes against my whole little little uh, Vlad theory. <laughs> <laughs> but that's really interesting lore. It's also interesting to hear that maybe Greg didn't want this and that's why he's so angry. I wonder if something happened to her and that's why he's so mad. Oh, I want to know so bad. Is there more like diary entry to it? Read it again. If I have a different sim read it, maybe she'll get something else out of it. I write today with a heavy heart. My closest confidant and most daring friend, Yina Kia, has left this planet. It was a cow plant. Those blasted abominations of the Moo casters. In certain hands, magic can do beautiful things. In others, it can create some of the galaxy's greatest monsters. Cow plants, vampires, and perhaps some would say us. No way you're comparing a cute little cow plant to a vampire. Do werewolves belong on that list? I know John and Maria would adamantly disagree. Oh. Today, I broke a few doors during a rampage and somehow even destroyed Avelina's telescope. Once I transformed back to myself, I could see how distraught she was. I took the wood from a broken door and repaired the telescope's leg. I am no woodworker, but my dear told me she liked it better this way. I am often reminded what a lovely woman she is. I am so fortunate. Oh, wait, and I think that the telescope is Avelina's telescope. Oh my gosh. Like the new telescope from the pack is the telescope they're talking about. Look, it's got one repaired leg. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm obsessed with the lore in this pack. That just made my day. Oh no. The library says it's incomplete because I destroyed everything in it. Oops. <laughs> okay, well, I wanted to go to the bar because I wanted to be nice to people in my wolf form because my pack is mad at me and I can actually be become a wolf now so I can do it finally. Oh, that's 
a that's a rampaging Katrina Caliente, if I've ever seen one. All right, keep it up then, bestie, keep it up. <laughs> Have fun. Okay, I'm going to transform and you're going to be nice. We're gonna do a friendly introduction over here. Okay, I have to pee, so I'll do that first. Why can't I use the toilet? Oh, sorry, I, I totally missed the do a savage poo option. <laughs> That's my bad. Well, I already fixed my diplomacy by doing that. Literally just talking to him once fixed it. So I bet if we just come do a bunch more friendly introductions, it should be fine. Okay, well, I turned this guy's wife into a werewolf, so I probably should be nice to him. Well, I guess I didn't do it, it was my sister, but you know. <laughs> We look very similar, so I feel like maybe he wouldn't know. <laughs> How often do you see werewolves in Willow Creek? Not much until, um, you know, like this week, actually. Oh my god, you're already gonna rampage again? Like, why? <laughs> How? I think I might buy some more like hunting related things with this sim. Maybe I'll get the lunar blessing one too to have like extended benefits from the moon. Oh, can you just go rampage and get it over with? It's still not happening. Do you think I could go beat up the pack leader then? Maybe me rampaging will help. Oh, Rory. Oh, she's not out here anyway. Boo. Maybe I somber howl to try and decrease my fury a little. Okay, that's better. Rory. Come on out wherever you are. I'm just waiting. Rory. God, it's so early. Why is nobody awake? I guess I can just call my pack mates to the hangout. It's not that hard. <laughs> I guess I could have just done that. Hi, Rory. I'm here because I would like to challenge you to an epic tug of war. Come on. I'm actually an apex wolf this time. Oh my god. <laughs> I suck. It's like every single day we keep trying to do it and it never works. Brutus is growing older. Before my transformation, when I was like any other spellcaster, he was my familiar. Though that particular connection is now lost, we still share a kinship in the moon itself, in our sharp fangs, our fighting prowess. In a way, he has become my brother, and I am already weary of how it will feel to watch him slow down. <gasps> oh my god! So Greg used to be a spellcaster. Understandably, he's real angry, because everyone he loved has died, and he's got this curse of the wolf. Oh, Greg! I feel bad for him! I know he, like, beat me up randomly yesterday in the last episode, but whatever. You know, that's fine. Everybody has bad days. Like me, I'm having a bad day. <gasps> Wait, I won! I won! Oh, ho, ho. This is the face of a pack leader. Aspiration completed. Whoa, Taylor is like totally radical, dude. <laughs> Gross. Taylor has risen the ranks and proved to the world that the wild fangs are here to stay. What adventure will she conquer next? Leader, leader, pumpkin eater, Taylor is now the wild fangs alpha and official pack leader. New unlocks, unique power over pack membership and ranks, exclusive interactions with members of both packs and with a trailer hangout spot, and also a new guitar. <gasps> oh, no way. I'm so powerful. I know you can also change how it looks. Like right now it has the scary one, but I can put the friendly one on. Watch, come on, stop and change it. See, I can make it cute. Moon would collective notice. Oh my god, leave Wendy alone. She's had a rough day. I can also make it normal or I can make it intimidating. Oh, maybe intimidating's better. <laughs> Actually, I kind of, I kind of like the friendly one. I don't think I'm very friendly, but it's cute. You know what? I think this little mini series has gone very well. I feel like we kind of properly explored a lot of different parts of the pack. We certainly didn't play the whole thing. There's like so much more stuff to still do. We definitely have not done it all. And that's kind of the beauty of the pack as well. Like it feels very replayable to me. You could definitely go through the whole thing again and, and try and do like the, the cure aspiration. You could try and do the lone wolf aspiration. We barely even touch the, the Moonwood Collective really. There's seriously so much in this pack. It's been a lot of fun. I hope that you enjoy the little mini series. I will say I'm feeling real good right now because I've been pre-recording for a long time to try and get like two weeks worth of videos ready to go up so I can go visit Dan's family. When you're seeing this, I'm there and I, I won't be back for a few days, but this is the last video I'm recording. The rest are all done already. So I'm feeling like a real sigh of relief. I'm actually leaving tomorrow and I'm good. After this, I am done. <laughs> so thank you for watching. Have a great rest of your day. If you like The Sims, I post videos like this one and like Sims content every day on YouTube, so feel free to subscribe, and I'll catch you all tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Also, I guess if you want to follow me on Instagram, you can see some, like, pics of my trip. Probably I'm gonna try and post more, because I'm not so good at taking pictures, but I'm gonna be traveling, so I should at least try, right?